title of my research is it's time to gripe and share the data. And what I've been doing over the last seven years is working with a large network of researchers around Australia and in fact around the world to try and pull biology into the sphere that astronomy and oceanography went 20 and 50 years ago. And the reason for this is as a, as a community we can make an enormous contribution to science but biology has traditionally worked on small individually focused projects. So we've developed a large central data repository where people working with animals in the marine environment, so sharks, fish, seals, seabirds, even whales, um, can put their data into an area so that if, if their animal goes beyond where they're normally working but somebody else picks it up, they can find that out. And what this means is that we have enormous value adding to the research that's being done by all of the individual projects. We use devices such as this. This is a conductivity temperature satellite relay data logger. And what it does is we glue it to a seal or another large marine animal. And as the animal dives, it records information. And when it comes to the surface, the antenna sticks out of the water and it sends it up to the Argos satellite network. All of that data is processed centrally in Scotland and then we put it out onto the GTS server which is an oceanographic database. Now we're interested in what happens to the biology of the animals, but oceanographers can tap in and use that data, and they've already used it just this year to find out new sources of Antarctic bottom water, and it's completely transformed our idea about, in fact, oceanographic circulation around the Southern Ocean.